Hey guys, it's American X-Men here, and I'm back with the battle. Um, I wanted to have it, like, play the animation, but it didn't. Um, I wish it did, but whatever. This is the same fight that they played in the, uh, what's it called? The little presentation. And I felt like they jumped way too much. Like, especially fighting the boss, but, like, I mean... Just use your, like, stuff when you can. And I keep getting hit, I don't know why. And he's dead, because I am just way too strong. That would have taken me a while to beat. I keep saying that. Um... Yeah, there are little blocks up there. I might get them. Yeah, I'll, I'll get them. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. They're not just gonna have you do that. Okay, just... A mushroom and a thing. That's fine, that's fine. Ugh. I don't know, I don't really know what to talk about. Like, I mean, I, I noticed that Game Grumps usually has something to talk about or joke about because there's two people and they're really good friends, but that's what makes them probably one of my favorite YouTube gameplay people. Just because they have, like, more things to talk about than one person. Like, I mean, one person can talk about something all they want, but wouldn't you rather have two people talking than one? J just saying. Uh, yeah, I love... These little T-Rex guys were in, um partners in time as well, and I was super happy about that. This part was hard, on the touch screen. The part where I had to like diagonally jump from there to there, that was like the hardest part. But it's too easy now. Look at him! There we go. So I'm almost at the top of the mountain. I think I'm gonna have an, another boss. Like I know I have another boss, but I don't. I didn't know how close it was. I'll do the, that on these guys. Just to take the bone guy off on my own. There we go. And then Mario levels up. And it'd be awesome if Luigi leveled up, but... Do power. Just make him incredibly overpowered. <laughs> Does he kill all of them? <laughs> he kills the little guy. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, now we're doing the same to Luigi. Forty-nine power this early in the game is ridiculous. Alright, alright. Uh, a little too far there, but it's alright. Uh, 
That's a quicker way to get up the stairs, I never knew that. Well, whatever, I'll, I'll try it. Yeah. Uh, I can't reach it. You. I gotta time this just right. That was not right. That was far from right. After playing this game for several years, I can't believe I didn't even know some things. Bull. <gasps> no! I went the wrong direction. Just that alone can kill him. Oh my god. I have overpowered this game too much. Like, I mean, it's not it's nothing compared to what's gonna happen later in the game, but still, this early in the game. <gasps> no, come on! Jeez, okay. You know what? We can just jump on these guys. Wow, okay, not even let me jump. Whatever, it's fine. You know. You're gonna be dead anyway. I love how the head has to return to the body before dying. So, I got a question for you guys. What do you think about Mario Kart Wii? Because my friend was like, oh, it's the greatest Mario Kart I've ever played. Or in the world. And I'm like, it, like, I mean, it's alright, but it's not the best. And he, like, just, I don't know, just hated on me ever since. Like, I mean, we're still friends and stuff, but he just, like, jokes around saying it's the best one when I think it isn't. I don't think it is because, oh my, what? Did I just go right through it? All right, whatever. But um, I gave a compelling argument on why Mario Kart Wii isn't anymore the best Mario Kart. Because one, 50cc is like, is way too slow. And you can't, you can't change the controls. What? The... There we go. Okay. But yeah, you can't can you cannot change the controls. So then it's like the buttons like in Mario Kart 8 for the Wii U. Um you just aren't able to do that. And the controls are like really janky and like I mean at the time this was probably the best game in the world. One of like the best Mario Kart to come out. Been playing for an hour and five minutes. Alright, how long is this episode? Nine minutes. I could fit another boss in there. Fools! Oh, I... It's called a hoo hoo block. Um. Beef in my book. Blabladong. Okay. I mean, he'll help later in the story to get up to Bowser's castle, but then he then he comes out. That's how we get our hammers. <laughs> I 
Alright, this is this will be the end of the episode after this fight. So, um I'll probably easily beat him, just considering how much power I've gotten. Yeah, 40? No one's supposed to be that strong in this in the beginning. Probably this will end it. Yep. Prince Peasley. There we go. And his nice shining hair. Look at that hair. Jeez. Oh. That hair. <laughs> and he rides in a... What is that? It's like a flying... thing. I don't know what it is. Alright, this is my chance to get myself to the little town. Alright, so I, I think there was two bosses in one episode. That's pretty cool. Um, so after this, I am going to, you know, go to the little town and do that stuff. Um, yeah. So I... We'll see you guys later.